All right, so obviously you're here, you're having some dishwasher issues. I'm gonna just cover the, the most common problem with most dishwashers. If it's beyond this, unless you really know what you're doing, you might as well either throw your dishwasher out or get a repair guy. But anyways, if your dishwasher isn't draining properly or you're getting a lot of food residue that seems to hang out in there when it's all done or uh, very common if you're hearing a lot of grinding noise, I'm gonna show you how to fix that. And I'm gonna do that by showing you how to put the dishwasher together. I already have it apart, so I can show you the primary cause of uh, most of the, the issues that uh, you're gonna have here for the dishwasher. Um, so okay, I'll show you where, where all the action happens here. Right down there, when your dishwasher's running, um, there's this a metal wheel here with a cutter on there that grinds up food. And what happens in that housing, once I show you how to put it back on, um, food, uh, hard objects, glass, uh, you see my band-aid, I found some glass in there, just so, so be careful, uh, plastics, whatever, gets all in there, plugs it up, it doesn't drain or else it can't uh, function properly, makes grinding noises, alright, so here we go, I'm going to make it quick, just get lined up here. And I'll show you the parts as we go along here. All right. So to get to that little grinder thing, this is the housing. You have to remove this housing. I'm gonna put it back on now. And basically, so I mean, if you're gonna if you're gonna disassemble, everything's in reverse. So you just run the video backwards. Anyway, set that back down in there should just slide in nice and straight. And you know it's in there properly if you grab it and you can't move it this way, but you could lift it up this way to get it out. So it kind of locks in there. See that? All right. Now there's one screw that you have to put in there. It's located right down in there. And we'll just get that started. Try not to drop it. All right. I need smaller hands. Sometimes a pair of pliers comes in handy. Just get that in the lined up in there. Let it go. Get out your drill. And don't over tighten things, just tighten it up so it's kind of snug in there. All right, that's all done. Now the next piece to go on, this is the, uh, the uh, strainer so that particles don't go into the pump. So this thing, we just need to put it back in. It just sits on there. And looking good. Put the screws in. There's four of them here. Get them lined up. Hopefully you can see everything I'm doing here. Yeah, I think so. Okay. These are, these uh, take, uh, I think they're called Torx ends. The one I just put in before this, the smaller one, this one's a little bit bigger size. You want to put them in, don't, don't screw them right down hard. You kind of go back and forth in this pattern to get it even. All right, and then just do a quick go, go around. Again, don't over tighten them. I'm almost a little bit over tight on those, but it'll be all right. Okay, so that's that. The next piece that goes on is this thing. It's, uh, that holds the metal washer thing, you see. 
And this, you don't jam it down in there. Like, some people will jam it in there, but just set it on there. Okay, so we have that in. The next piece to go in, this is the, I don't know what the right word for it is, water distribution thing. I'm not a dishwasher in here, guys. Anyways. Lined up here. And it has a just kind of have to turn it a bit here. And it should sink. It should sit down. Okay. And there's two screws for that. It's normal. But anyways, two little screws here. Just holds it in place. Some of them snap in. Some of them have screws. Some of them have bolts. Yeah, this one snaps a little bit at the top. can't see this but it's just a screw nothing magical going on Get started there we go snug up there okay pretty easy so far now your washer bar oh just a sec sorry a little plastic ring hard to see maybe but anyways that goes on first and that just makes it so that the metal on here can slide easy you just set that on there and just a here. that was too far down see that's the thing see it was pushed too far down must have hit it or something. But anyways, put that back on. And you'll see there's a little notch. And you just kind of thread that on. And this doesn't have to be overly tight or anything. Just give it a few turns. Spins. Good stuff. Okay, um, <laughs> Believe it or not, that's everything. Well, except for the drawers. We'll put those in. I'm going to start with the top drawer. Put that out. Move this up a bit. You just have to line up the wheels and the rails. Um, I don't know, in the old days, it's just, you need a little, I use this uh, little, uh, and for my drill here, basically they just go like this, and there's a little clip, kind of have to lift it up a bit, snap it over, it stays on there, do this one, okay. This just put it in there and lift it. Push it over. There. There. 
there. The drawer stays in. Bottom drawer, well, that's a piece of cake. Well, not really a piece of cake, but you know what I mean. And start washing your...